Thoughts on the game first and, and the ability of your guys to rally? Well, you know, I, I'll be very honest. The, uh, to be able to win two, a two-game series uh, against a quality opponent like Cornell is, is, uh, is a huge confidence builder for us. Um, certainly Mike Schaefer and his staff have done a great job every year. They're one of the top teams in the East, top teams in the ECAC, and, and uh, I'm sure that that's the way they'll finish this year as well. Um, so certainly, uh, you know, it's interesting because I thought at times we played better tonight than we did last night, but that really doesn't indicate, you know, it doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to have a, a better score. Um, but I was certainly to be able to be in that position in the third period where it's anybody's game and be able to not only figure out a way to score a goal but then defend it from that point on, um, it's a good experience for our guys. And, uh, Certainly a little, a little bit of a nail-biter uh, towards the end, but uh, you know, Yuho Wolkanara continues to play very well for us and gives us a lot of confidence up there. Talk about having a, you know, kind of an unsung guy like Jacobson here you know, for a like Well, you know, I, I think everybody realizes that Larkin Jacobson uh, uh, was suspended for a considerable length of time in the first half of the schedule, and uh, I'm very proud of how he responded to that uh, uh, prior to tonight. Uh, he held himself accountable, uh, approached everything in a very mature adult fashion and, and has done everything. It's, it's been a great example to the rest of the guys in the locker room about, okay, if I make a mistake, uh, I'm going to own up to it and I'm going to do whatever I need to do to be able to uh, make things right. And Larkin has done that and, and I think that, as I said before, it's a great example to the rest of his teammates. Certainly Larkin is not a, has never been a guy who on our team is a uh, plays a role in the score, but he drove harder than that. David Mikowski made a wonderful play in driving wide and driving deep into the zone and put it right on Larkin's stick. I think the only critique I would have is uh, Larkin's got to figure out a new way to celebrate. <laughs> uh, what do you think was behind some of the power play struggles tonight? Two five-minute majors and, and kind of ineffective? Well, you know, I, it, it, we didn't make any changes, um, but I think they did. I think they, they adjusted to what we were, some of the things we were doing last night. They cut off some of the shooting lanes. I thought they did a much better job tonight of um, jamming up the neutral zone. There were a number of times where we were not able to gain possession of the puck in the offensive zone. We were doing too much uh, individual stick handling, slowing things down, and then all of a sudden we would run out of space, we'd have to chip it in, and all of a sudden they were, they were getting it and throwing it down the ice. Um, I thought their goaltender played very well. We had, we had a couple of great opportunities where we didn't put the puck in the net. Sometimes it's just a matter of just a matter of a half an inch. I know we hit at least one post on the power play tonight. Um, you know, it's it's you know uh, when you're hot, you're hot type of thing. And, and our power play was good last night. Um, tonight we had to battle it out and, and uh, uh, rely on our penalty kill and, and our even strength play to get us the win.